Hey everybody and welcome back to another video from your best buddy. We got another follow along here. This time I don't have a plan. So we're going to start from scratch. I don't have anything to go off of. Uh so usually when I go from scratch I I either do a baseline or a drum line. And I think I'm going to go with a baseline first uh to uh start off with, but First, let's get our tempo. I want this to be a faster, like a, like a dun, 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 that, 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 that tempo. Let's see what we got. So, so dun, 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 150. Dun, 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 A little too slow. 170, maybe. Bop, 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 yeah. All right, that's what we're going to do. We're going to get a bass line. We're going to find a good bass. We're going to get the line in. We'll be right back. All right, so here's what we got. A nice little bass riff. It's a good riff. Uh, I'm gonna add some effects to it. Obviously, you gotta get the reverb. Ooh, pedal maybe? No, 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 no. But reverb, yes. Reverb, yes. Pedal, no. Reverb, yes. Pedal, maybe. Pedal, maybe. Reverb, yes. You know what? Let's mess around with the pedal. Uh. Uh. Oh. Give some gnarl. See if this works. It's not a piano, but let's see if we get some gnarl. <laughs> sure why not let's let's stick with that for now all right now that we got a bass line we're going to get the drums in there so i'm going to create a quick drum rack and then get a drum line All right, so I, I've got a uh, little drum line set up here. You saw me build it a little bit in the fast motion, but uh, in the time lapse. But uh, so I'm trying to build some tension here, and I, I think I, I was trying to do that with the drums. So we'll see how it sounds, see if it builds some tension. I think it does. And from there, who freaking knows? <laughs> Let's get some reverb on that drums though. Because I want to. Like, I don't I need more reverb. Can never have enough. All right, sorry about that. I had to fix some stuff there. <laughs> that was bothering me. But anyways, let's uh uh let's get some like a synth. I don't know. Let's get a synth. Let's find a synth. But I want like a like a a buzzy synth. Like a I think they're called saws. Let's look up saw. Saw. So those aren't the sounds I'm really looking for. I want I want something that's like <laughs> that, you get what I mean, right? 
That's close. Let's see how this sounds. Let's give it a quick run on the MIDI. Uh-oh, I didn't mean to do that. I made the drums turn into that, so we'll see. I don't know, man. I'm going to troubleshoot shoot this synth here. I'm going to put a note. Two notes, just to, just to kind of get a sound I'm looking for. So I'll be right back. So, okay, so I got something ridiculous going on. I don't even know what the heck you could even call it. I definitely need to uh, lower the volume on what I just added real quick. So let's let's take it down to negative 40 decibels, but, but you'll hear what I got. So let's play it from the top. I still think it's building tension, which is not ideal. Like you, you need some sort of resolution, but <laughs> I just, it sounds so it's amplified. Like you're, you're getting amped, right? This is like, this is like, whoa, you know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe you don't, but anyways, I'm going to make a, tra a quick transition here. Uh, uh, see if we can make something sound good. So I'm going to keep the baseline the same probably because I think what I'm, what I have in my head will work with the baseline. So I'm going to get a, a voice, a quick sound to add in. I don't know what it's going to be, but we'll, uh, we'll add it and see how it sounds. so here's what we got now added a little bit of a uh uh higher melody um i i used a bass that can't so the sound itself doesn't do chords like it, it, if you try to do two notes at the same time it'll do this you hear like it, it's it's kind of overlapping itself so i had to make a group of uh of three of them so i could do the chords i wanted to do and i had a little gap and a, a, like a little rest period before like like a baby drop almost <laughs> but here's what we got i'm gonna start it right here And so at right here, like, so right now, essentially the song can be done. Like it, 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 all these elements I can use to like make like a, you know, like a, a minute and a half, two minute song. 
I would just copy paste and, and split things up and, and do like little manipulations like this little gap and stuff like that to add some variation to make it interesting and sound interesting. But I do want to add a little more uh, fun little sound effects. So on the second round of the uh, high theme, I want there to be an offbeat kind of like ding, not necessarily a ding, but some sort of like loud thing. <laughs> so I'm going to work on that and we'll be back and see how that goes. All right, I got my little uh, uh, semitone things going on. Let's uh, extend this a little bit so it doesn't sound silly. <laughs> but I also added a little bit to the transition. So we're going to start from here, say, and let's see how it sounds. <laughs> All right, so <laughs> so they, anybody who's written music or or anything like that, there's a point in like music when you're writing where in your head, like you can you can imagine you hear gaps in what you've written, like you would hear like gaps in the in the flow of the song, in like little bits inside what when you're listening to it, and you can hear in your head where it could likely go. You know, it's the poetics of the song, right? If you know what poetics means. If you don't, uh, look it up because <laughs> I don't remember off the top of my head. I know how to use it in a sentence though. <laughs> but anyways, so like like I say that because in my head, I can, f I hear where it needs to transition from right here. So I'm going to get that done real quick. See if I can manage it. All right, here's a little update on what I got. It's it's quiet because I don't have everything else going on. I'm I'm really working on like the high theme or the the higher pitched melody. So, here's what we got in the middle of all the mix. <laughs> It's not going to be a large diversion, but it's going to, it's good. It's about to wrap up here and then go back to the, the heavy metal. <laughs> I don't know. Could you consider this metal? I don't know with the drum line. It's got like the double, like the double bit, uh, the double bass drum thing going on. Double pedal. <laughs> but anyways, you can call it whatever you like. I, I, I think it's got a metal ish feel. So what if it doesn't have a double amp guitar? <laughs>
anyways, I'm going to finish this off, see if I can get some of this other stuff uh, to go with it, and we'll see how we do. All right, so I got it mixed out a little bit. We'll start in the mix. I don't have the high. I don't have the bass, drums, and whatever this uh, thing is doing. I don't have any of that down yet, but uh, here's what I got as far as the, uh, the kind of break and the tension a little bit. <laughs> missing this this is there should be also one like right here yeah all right so that's what i got i'm gonna work on these up here and we'll get right back to it All right, so I got the secondary bass going on. Whatever, whatever this thing's doing. <laughs> Just kind of like a machine gun going off a little bit. So I got that in there. I got a little variation up there. Also got the change the drums up. Slows down a little bit because the whole theme slows down a little bit. So that's what we got going on. So here's what we got. Yeah, we're getting it. We're getting it. We're about to wrap up here. We got to get this bass in and then we'll get ourselves a little ending and that'll be that. That'll be a lot, nice little song, huh? All right. Well, hopefully you're able to follow along well enough. <laughs> uh, I know I'm, I'm not explaining so much about what I'm doing. Uh, hopefully you'll be able to follow along because I think visual learning is, is quite important. I know some people aren't visual learners, but I am. So that's the only way I know how to, sh how to teach. <laughs> So we're going to get this bass in and then we'll go and figure out the end. got our bass in uh that's everything together <laughs> let's see what it sounds like this this it's just a basic bass so here's here's the bass kind of just like a climb uh climbs up falls back down but here's what we got with it all together let's turn off the solo there and let's get what we got <laughs> So right here, here's going to be a, a little uh, transition point, probably adding more effects just to kind of build up the end here. And the end is not going to be anything fantastic. It's just going to kind of just, <laughs> just kind of end, just, just how it, like, like how it ends here. 
You know, it's just going to go and then be done <laughs> because I'm not creative. Um, but we're going to get in this uh, halfway point of the final stretch, get something interesting in there, maybe a different instrument, uh, just kind of doing like a woo 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 in the background and we'll see how that goes. Okay, <laughs> geez, Ableton was starting to act up on me a little bit, so I got a little aggravated. But uh, we got ourselves a little uh, something of an ending, and we got a. I added like the like the finishing touch, I guess you want to call it. I mean, obviously, it's not finishing touches. I could work on this song for hours and hours and days and days, and never be happy with it. So I'm gonna call it for this episode and for this song. But let's hear it from the top one last time and if you like this video why don't you go ahead and hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed already why don't you go ahead and do that too for me that'll make me feel real good and check out my soundcloud uh it should be in the description uh that's where i post all my music that i do for this channel so go ahead and check that out after you watch this video and i'll see you in the next one bye